Okay, so today guys, I'm going to talk to you about USB. So, um, here's the first USB dongle I made, and it didn't work well. As you can see, uh, it's made from salvage parts, and it's some uh, ninja soldering. Yeah, I was getting kind of proud of it, but didn't work as, as planned. So, this is the second one. It's currently plugged in with my uh, O-scope, one channel O-scope from uh, C, it's pretty cool. Okay, down to the stuff. Um, as you can see, um, we basically just tap in between two wires of USB. One is currently plugged with my webcam, uh, spitting out continuous stream of data right there. Woohoo! See, it's working. And that data is being intercepted and seen right here. On the other side, you have a power LED, which is always useful. You got a power jumper right here. If our, uh, you can remove that and add an ammeter to uh, see how much power it's cur currently using. You can also tap into uh, a voltmeter. Just give me a sec. There you go. And you see how stable the power is right now at 4.96. And that is still coming out. So that is my USB dongle in a nutshell. It's pretty easy to build yourself and it's pretty useful. If you want to have some more uh, in-depth analysis of the, the protocol, you could always go with uh, this bus pirate version 3 or something like that with a whole bunch of wires. Or as I said before, I'm going to try to use an STM32 with uh, my four wire cable right there, plug it here and try to uh, decode the NRZ data and then I'm, I'm gonna try to make a Arduino version of it so everyone can enjoy and play with their USB toys. If you got any question just post a comment. Have a good day.